Hi, my name is Ahmad. Uh, this is a video update and it's a proof of concept video of a newer VAF design that I'm trying out. Uh, this is a adaptation of uh, a VAF design that's been used already on the aquaponic uh, community. I just merely make it uh, different. It's function just like that uh, auto siphon with the tube. Uh, the reason I need to use this valve is to because I need to uh, hook up a lot of growth bait, smaller growth bait, and. Uh, then I can only use one pump and one valve. Let me go through the system. I have uh, in this particular example, I have uh, four growth bait hook up and they are linked together on the at the bottom just uh, with uh, T adapter you can use about 50 millimeter or 2 inch adapter and just make a hole uh, at the bottom of the growth bit and link them up together uh, don't mind the, the leak because I did not put any glue on this uh, system it's just uh, I'm just testing it out okay uh, this common manifold at the bottom of the growth bit is where you Route the water to the fish tank, and you have a swivel point, a T adapter here to make as a swivel point where the water will go up and then back down to the outlet. Okay, uh, this is where the siphon is created. Okay, uh, with this arrangement. One, this valve can be swivel to a different position so that you can adjust the water level in your growth bed. If you want to have a higher water level, you can just put it back to vertical and arrange it to vertical. Okay, right. Also, I've incorporated a drip. At, on this particular T at the bottom, I incorporated a drip, 2mm drip hole. If you decide to use this valve with a timer motor, so when you cut off the pump, the remainder water in your growth bed will be slowly drained out. However, if you decide not to use a timing motor, or you want to run the motor 24 hours you can just replace this T with an elbow so it will go up and down this is the reducer what happens is when the water flow in and due to the reducing size of this pipe it will create a better suction so your valve will operate better with a lower capacity pump okay and uh, the cycle is just like a normal bell valve but the bell has been moved outside of the growth bed and you can use this with multiple growth bed with a single pump and a single valve okay thank you very much this is a video update and uh, i will not be using this uh, growth bed currently because uh, i'm building a new a fish tank a fish uh, pond and hopefully you will be ready in about two to two or three weeks time then I will hook up multiple growth bait for that particular setup okay thank you very much bye